Erin Kelly, what an afternoon. You're into the fourth round. How are you feeling? Buzzing? Yeah, literally, like, it's amazing, isn't it? We've never, yeah. this is the furthest that I've ever been in the FA Cup, so yeah, actually, can't wait. Have you got any energy left, though, especially you, Kelly? I don't think, <laughs> I think that must be like the best game you've had all season. I generally wanted to die when they're about 10 minutes to go, and they're like, come on, 10 minutes, and I'm like, okay, okay, okay. Um, so yeah, towards the end, I was literally lacquered, but you've got to keep going, haven't you? The final whistle, and it was worth it. And of course, as well, Erin, you were the one that broke the deadlock mm -hmm. in the first half. A lovely, neat finish on your left foot. Is that your weaker foot? Yeah, definitely. I was, I, can't, I was thinking about it. I can't lie to go on to the right, but I thought I just got to hit it. You don't have a weaker. Um, I don't. <laughs> so I just went for it, and luckily it went in. I was just glad to break the deadlock. If it hadn't have gone in, I'd have been gutted. <laughs> And of course, as well, it was a bit of a physical one today. Did you expect West Brom to come and play that way? Yeah, we knew it was going to be physical. We knew they were a mm. strong team. Um, so we did, yeah, we were ready for it, but we stepped up and we battled well. Um. And of course, Erin, then as well, you get the penalty. Yeah. Was there much going through your mind for that pen? Uh, well, well, I try to clear my mind when I'm taking a penalty. So to be honest, I just block everything out and I think the players know as well. Even if they talk to me, I'll probably, I'm not going to be taking in what they're saying. I just try tried to clear my head and then put it where where I decide and not change my mind and luckily it just went in. And of course as well then Jane adds in a third. Was it disappointing especially for you Kelly about the goal that West Brom got because you looked so determined to make sure that clean sheet was yours? I was so frustrated by that goal went in too fair. I literally telling the girls at the back the whole time I was like come on clean sheet clean sheet we've got this. Um, to be fair I thought the player was all over Rose if I'm honest so I did think it was a free kick to us but um, at the end of the day we still came out with a, with a win, so um, only 16-1 is not so bad. But. What were like your expectations coming into the game? Did you have any sort of predictions in between the team? I predicted 3-1. I'm going to give the credit to me and Jane. <laughs> I predicted 2-1 with my dad the night before, like last night. So you done well? Yeah. <laughs> you and Jane knew that it was 3-1, yeah. so you wanted to score three goals between exactly. you. There you go. <laughs> there you, go. <laughs> you predicted it and you made it happen. Yeah. Of course now, into the fourth round, as you've alluded to, Kelly, it's the furthest you've been, but it's also, in modern history, the furthest the club has been. What does it mean for you guys as a team, having been in this since the second qualifying round? I'm well excited. Like, it's amazing, isn't it? Like, we, everybody wants to be in the FA Cup, and we seem to have knocked out two teams from the league above us, which obviously goes to show that, you know, we battle to the end and we work as a team really well together. So, um, yeah, I'm really excited to be in the, the fourth round. Yeah, just to back that up as well, we're, we were buzzing as a team just to, to get this far and then to come away and, as you've said, beat two teams that are in a higher league than us. It really shows that this team, you know, we can go far in this competition and we're just excited to see tomorrow who we get drawn next. Of course, that draw is on TalkSport 2 at 5 o'clock for anyone wanting to uh, check that out. In that draw will be championship sides and Super League sides. Who do you want and do you want it home or do you want it away? Away? I love an away day. I want to go away. Um, I don't know who I want. I'm saying home to Liverpool. I want to bring Liverpool to Romsey. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to go away to Chelsea. I would. There you go. Thank you very much, girls. Thank Thanks. you. <laughs>